Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to go about resolving a Microsoft Windows PowerShell error when you're attempting to write or run PowerShell or batch scripts where you come across that you are unable to run the script because running scripts are disabled on this system. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start this tutorial off by opening up the start menu. Type in Windows PowerShell. Best manage to come back a Windows PowerShell here. Go ahead and right click on that and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now I am going to have a command in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy that. So just highlight it over it, right click and copy, and then go up to the top bar of the Windows PowerShell window you see here. Right click on it one time, select edit, and then select paste. Hit enter on your keyboard. Tap the Y key on your keyboard, it's just the letter Y. Hit enter, and then that should be about it. Attempt to run whatever commands or scripts you're having an issue with before, and that should be able to resolve the problem. So please keep in mind you did need administrator rights in order to run that command. So pretty straightforward process here guys. Do hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.